Meet Bicycle! Hello everybody! Welcome back to another episode of the Legendary Run here on Borderlands 2. No! <laughs> what am I talking about? Borderlands the pre-sequel. I haven't played Borderlands 2 in a few days actually, I don't know why I said that. So uh, yeah, we are recording straight from where we left off actually, um, just for this little part because um, I actually want to record this as part of another video as well. So uh, in the last episode, right at the end, we finished farming Zarpedon. What a result as well. We ended up getting a... Uh, uh, our prismatic bulwark off the uh, uh, ascending Zarpedon in the second run, but before that in the uh, Colonel Zarpedon we've got the ZX1 as well, so two drops in the same run was absolutely awesome. And uh, yeah, then we finish off by coming down into this little chess room. So, there is a little exploit with this chess room where uh, you're only supposed to be able to farm this once and then uh, that's it. But, if, as long as you don't exit this area, you can quit out and uh, come back in whenever you want. So I'm just going to force the game to save very quickly now by toggling my ballast rank because I had it in read only last time because you're only supposed to be able to farm Zarpedon once but we wanted to get at least one legendary from her. So uh, yeah, like I said, um, once you open all them chests up, as long as you don't go up there uh, and exit this area, you can just quit out and uh, come back in and uh, farm the chest room over and over again as many times as you want. So uh, I just thought it'd be a good idea to just do a few runs of this now and uh, just see what we... Uh, what we get so uh, yeah let's just go ahead now and I just uh, just take a little while to get there but uh, as long as you stick with it it shouldn't take you too long you do have to come through all of this uh, annoying little area but you don't actually um, come on there we go you don't actually have to uh, to exit this area if you don't want to so uh, let's go ahead and uh, just sell that and uh, we'll check the vendors every time as well you never know when you might get yourself uh, a legendary from those vendors but uh, yeah so uh, we shouldn't be in this area right now we should be carrying on with our uh, little fight but uh, let's just check I've still got my uh, ZX1 I have so my read only has uh, worked and uh, yeah all you got to do is just head down this ramp again and uh, you can farm the chest room again and uh, do that as many times as you want so uh, not bothered about these things in the middle but I want that one to spawn and I want that one to spawn and that one to spawn. There we go. So, let's see if we can get anything good. And we'll just uh, stock up on a bit of items, a bit of ammo. And, uh, yeah, we'll just do this a couple of times. Wow, that chest was taking a long time. Come on. There we go. Nice little purple there. Might do this a few times off camera, actually. Um, shall, we, for that, sorry, shall we make this our legendary? Shall we make this our legendary? Uh, and what I mean by that is uh, I'm just going to uh, do a few runs of this on camera and uh, then if we can't get anything good I'll just do this by myself over and over again. We're not going to get anything out of these loot lockers but if we can get something out of there, there or there, that's three chests. It might take me a hell of a lot of runs but I think guys today is going to be our legendary from a chest, random from a chest. Oh god, I'm going to regret this because chess legendaries are really, really difficult to get hold of. But, I think we're nearly out of uh, bosses, farmable bosses anyways. And we've got quite a long way to go before uh, the end. So I am going to have to start limiting the amount of bosses we farm now. Let me think, what's after this? Uh, sorry, let's check that vendor while we're here. Sell all that we don't want. How have I only got... Oh no, I thought I had 58,000. I've got 581, that's alright. Um, I can't think of what levels we've got next. It's... Uh, no, we've only got Virago Solitude. Don't think there's any bosses in Virago Solitude. No, there isn't any farmable bosses in Virago Solitude, is there? Oh, we've got Tycho's Ribs. Again, no bosses in there, I don't think. And then it's on to, uh, on to uh, Ellis here. We've got RK5, but he doesn't, uh, he doesn't drop any legendary weapons. I think we're out of farmable bosses, you know, till uh, the Sentinel. I'm probably being a big noob, though, and uh, someone's probably screaming at me right now. Oh, you forgot about blah, blah, blah. But uh, for the minute, I cannot think of any farmable bosses. So we're going to have to... Uh, yeah, we are going to have to uh, make do with what we've got. So, I think 
today's legendary is going to come out of a chest and it'll probably take me a flipping age and a half to uh, actually do it but uh, it don't matter now I'm just going to fill up on uh, fill up on items here and then just sell them so yep there you go that's two runs of the chest room I'm pretty sure they're the only chests let's just check through here in case there's one that spawns here no there isn't oh my god can you get oh what a noob guys what a noob okay so we have got a much much quicker way now oh you've just seen a fail than half I did not know you could do that I did not know you could do that right so uh, this is much quicker now all you have to do is come through here yes all you've got to do is come through here wow we can make that oh no that door has just disappeared am I missing something here Wait for it. I was gonna say am I being a big noob here right let's just go round oh is it I think it's over here then is it over here by the vendors yes it is right okay I'm with it now okay well this is much quicker all you've got to do then is uh, come through here you don't have to go all the way around that is good that's gonna help us no end I'm glad I looked for that then so uh, it's much quicker now than uh, it was originally so I'm gonna do two more quick runs of this and then uh, I'll do some off-camera farming and uh, we'll start our legendary episode off today our legendary run by uh, getting a legendary out of these chests here now I'm gonna get a shed load of money from selling all these weapons as well so that will really set us up not that we need the money at the minute but uh, yeah there you go so uh, all we've got to do now is we can make this a hell of a lot quicker I'm glad I found that actually very glad I went exploring then um, yep yeah, okay let's quit out and one more run so if you want to get some guesses down now you'd have to put it in the comments because you'll probably uh, you'll probably uh, wait you'll see it in the next run but uh, if you want to have a little guess to yourself how many times it's going to take me to uh, actually do this I will try and keep track of it actually so uh, we all we've got to do is wait for this to disappear and then we can just farm it I wish there was a way of shutting that down a bit quicker but uh, hey there we go so uh, nice little vendor check I'm only going to check the weapons vendor because we don't need any grenades or uh, shields at the minute we purely just want weapons I think so last run before uh, I farm off camera by myself and like I said if you want to get a guess in I'll uh, go back and just check all of these and check that, uh, how many runs I've done so far. But uh, three red chests is pretty good and uh, like you can see as well there's a shed load of loot lockers in the middle as well. That's very handy. Right, let's get all these. What have we got over there? Anything good? No. A couple of uh, moonstones and money. Oz kits. Right, okay, so I will continue to farm this off camera by myself. Oh no, you've, you have got to look at them and have you before they spawn. Yes, you do. Yeah, I'm going to farm this uh, off camera by myself now and uh, just carry on until I get what I want. Hopefully, it'll be a legendary uh, weapon, but uh, it'll be the first legendary that pops up. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in a second. Right then, legendary hunters, here we are. And uh, we have not just got one legendary. I decided to push the boat out and go for two. Took an absolutely long time to find one in a chest, though. I uh, will admit the first one wasn't too bad really the first one we managed to get in uh, 16 runs of this treasure room uh, that's 16 runs from when I first started farming after this but uh, here it is in a chest it's a grenade and it is a nice corrosive pandemic grenade mod so very very happy at that one uh, not a bad grenade actually and uh, yeah really uh, should come in handy I always thought if um, Egghood didn't drop the blowfly, he probably should have been assigned this pandemic, especially if it's saying spread the sickness. It's just a dirty, corrosive looking grenade. I love it. So, uh, there you go, a bit of an overview for you guys on that one. So, that was our first uh, legendary drop, but I wanted a weapon as well, so I thought I'd carry on and uh, go for a weapon farm as well. And uh, luckily, my persistence uh, paid off. I think, uh, let me look, 31 runs was. Uh, was the number of runs for this one so not too bad really but uh, we got a shed load of money while doing all this as well but uh, like I said I was after a weapon and we got one we just got the ZX1 in the last episode the legendary uh, laser and now we've got the Kato Ninetales as well so that's two legendary lasers we've got now it's not as good as our uh, ZX1 damage is a bit better but everything else seems to be a lot lower 
Uh, but that doesn't matter, we've got ourselves uh, the Kato Ninetales as well, which doesn't drop from a boss. I always like finding uh, weapons in chests that we can't get from anywhere else apart from the grinder. That really helps us uh, not have to use the grinder at all. But uh, yeah, like I said, managed to get plenty of weapons, plenty of money. As you can see, we've got nearly a mil now, which doesn't sound a lot, but it is on playthrough one. Uh, we've got ourselves the Pandemic and the Kato Ninetales, so really happy at that. They are our legendary drops for this episode. I'll take you back to some live recording now, and uh, yeah, I'll see you in a second. Right, okay, so we are back now, and uh, I actually uh, will admit, after the uh, last legendary drops, I uh, stopped recording. So it's been a while since I actually uh, came and did this run, but uh, we got a couple of drops from the, uh, from the chest anyway. Uh, I believe it was that nine tails actually that we got and uh, also the pandemic so uh, yeah that's pretty good nice uh, little upgrade we've got quite a few lasers now as well after the uh, the ZX1 drop so uh, yeah let's get on then and progress through this uh, through this uh, storyline so uh, we'll do one more raid of the chest seeing as I've uh, only just come in so uh, right let's have check this wow I am full so uh, let me star the stuff that I have just got I have done already, I believe. Let's just check everything else is starred before I mass sell everything. Yeah, all the important stuff is. What have we got there? Two Akaks, yep. Yeah. But what? Oh, I got the 3DD1.E, didn't I? Yep. Yeah. Okay, right, well, let's uh, mass sell then. And uh, we will continue this run while I'm doing that. Let me just check that I am, uh, yes, I am recording. Okay, and go. Just had to check my uh, audio was actually recording then. Three, two, one. Go, 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 go. So, uh, yeah, quite happy that uh, I actually got these uh, legendary drops live. Well, not live on camera, but uh, actually got them on camera. I also did a little bit of a... Uh, did a little bit of a uh, video on it um, for a little guide as well. And uh, I can't remember if I got one legendary or two now. I think it was one. Right, anyway, let's uh, just clear up here. Is there any trouble about recording an episode and uh, actually stopping halfway through the episode and coming back to it? You can't remember what you've done. I think it was about a week ago where I recorded the, uh, the actual draw. So uh, let's clear all this stuff from the middle and we'll check the chests. Imagine an unplanned legendary drop now, that would be pretty epic, but it doesn't look like it. So, yeah, I'm full. Right, let's progress then. So, I believe we have to go through these doors and up the lift again. And uh, for bosses, I'm pretty sure that is it now for uh, our legendary drop. So, uh, unfortunately, I think we're going to have to uh, stick to vendor farms and things like that. Which is a bit of a shame. Right, let's, in fact there is a chest over here, I think. Oh, is there? No, there isn't. Whoa! Yeah, I shouldn't have done that. Ow. Yeah, I'm gonna go down if I'm not careful. I thought there was a chest over here. Obviously not. Right, I'd best do it run, actually, before that thing starts up again. Go, 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 go! I think I'm, no, I'm not safe on here, actually. Right, now I'm safe. Right, let's take down the uh, the eye. What's up there? Is that where I came out? I'm not sure. And this is where the magic happens. Yeah. Oi. Calm yourself. Yeah, the destroyer. Hmm. Roland. Oh yeah, he's not. I thought, why is Roland here? But he's not dead, obviously. This is uh, the pre of the sequel, so uh, Roland is still alive. Right. Let's go see Jack. Uh, yeah, we'll open that up. Why not? Hello, sir. See what we get here then. A load of purples and blues, but uh, it'll be worth more than white so let's get rid of all four of them and pick up all of these <laughs> hello what the hell is that the 
Yes, it is. Because I'm awesome. Destroyer's eye as a weapon? Yes. It was he a did. weapon already. All the Iridian remnants are. I just figured out how to use it. Boom. Anyway, how do we shut this thing down? Carefully. Even ignoring the weird ass eye, this type of reactor is highly volatile. You're feeding it something that amplifies its power, aren't you? Yes. Oh, uh, run off from the Iridium refinement process. That. that. And that. I don't know if I can go down yet, though. Because I remember jumping off here before thinking that I needed to be down there, and it was like, go and talk to Jack again. Oh, no. Yep, there. That's what it was. Did I get it? I think I did. Oh, just got to shut it down then. Right. I think you get two okay, and then it starts being an absolute gear. Trust me, sugar. Yeah, double crossing gits. There we go. Right, let's get to this one. Oh no, I was gonna say let's get to this one before it starts pulling us. Don't think I can jump or it's gonna pull me back. Yep, there we go. So uh, let's just stay here. Try to stop it dragging us. Oh no, 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 no. There we go. Go, go, quick, 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 quick. Hey, there we go. See ya. Yeah. Protective mode. Initiate reboot sequence. Let's go back then. Right, uh, lunar launching station then. There. And then we are safe. Where is the eye? Is that it going to be there? Yeah, it must be right over there. Right, let's reboot it then. Yay, I believe it's going to work. <coughs> Try and destroy us now. Let us stand safe here. Oh, great. What now? Jack. I'm sorry. I'm not warning. Singularity detected. Oh, no. Whoa! <laughs> Lilith. I'm not. Good job, everybody. What, Moxie? What the hell are you doing? Betraying you. You bastards. Two things I should have done a long time ago, you power hungry psychopath. What do you mean, Moxie? I'm watching you, Jack. And behind that smile, behind that hero complex, there's something wrong about you. If you come yeah, get some ammo. Alive, a lot of decent people will live to regret it. No, 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 no! Damn it, I trusted you, Marcy. Betrayed by my own girlfriend. Bye-bye, sugar. Hide. Boom. Damn it. The eye. Get up, you puff. That was one of a kind. Have a look inside you. Huh? Look at his chin. The things I could have died. Right. Get mad, Jack. Get mad. Let's go kick some ass. Right, let's go then. Next chapter. Uh, don't want any of them. Right. Let's go locate main excavation site. Brago Solitude then, I believe. Nice, nice, nice.
Wow, we're really coming up uh, towards the end of the towards the end of the story, aren't we? Let's uh, mass sell everything. There we go, and let's go to the dig site. Ah, deploy, teleport. There we go. Look at the stupid bin. Okay. Virago Solitude, it is. It's a massive map, but we don't actually spend very long on it in our uh, in our main uh, playthrough. Anyway, we just simply scoot right through it, straight to Tycho's ribs. I think I'm going to do that today. Just get to Tycho's ribs. Oh no, I've got to take down our our K5, haven't I? Oh god. Um. I mean, I have got. I ain't got a corrosive sniper. I've got that blowfly though, I wonder if that'll do any good. I know it's a pistol, but if I can get the blowfly shots on, I should be kicking ass. None of my uh Yeah, none of my Vault Hunter.exe will do any good against it either. We go there, we take what's inside it, and we use it to kill Lilith, Roland, and all I might have to uh break the rules a little bit isn't a legendary. In fact, no, I'm not. I'm going to try it without it. We don't break rules. Legendaries only. If I can't do it, I can't bloody do it. I'll have to go back and farm a, uh, farm a corrosive legendary sniper. Right. It's quite good XP, actually. I should really be uh, fighting these guys. Where the hell did he go? Where the hell did you get up there? Yeah, we'll just well, they're supposed to not that good XP. Oh, oh, yeah, well, Boom! Yeah. Super slam. That's a good loader. Oh god, not these gits. Don't let him ascend. That was close. That's a. This is a hip fight machine. So uh, I'm just gonna. No! Gun loader! Wow, yeah, it really is a hit by a machine. Now oh, let's see XE it, see what we get. Oh, talk fiesta. That'll help us out a little bit. Let's just take him down. May as well, I was just going to straight run through it all, but wow, this laser is pretty awesome actually. Don't ascend. That's how you stop them ascending. You just slam them. Right, when we're getting here, there is a red chest right at the beginning as well. Oi! Leave my boss alone. And you. Leave my boss alone. Well, this is going to eat ammo. That's a turret down. Two turrets down. Let's go then. Let's EXE it again. Why not? See what we get. Yes! Boom. 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 Oh, shot me in bot. Haha! <laughs> there we go. I love pirate ship mode. Ah, he got scum then. Oh, we should have uh, kept it going till this bit. Oh, great. I wonder how good this laser's going to be against Guardians, Defenders of the Vault. Uh, my pirate ship's gone, so uh, let's go and open this chest. We'll go in here and see if we can get any ammo out. Just try and escape the Guardians for a little bit. Don't know how good fire is against the Guardians, actually, but we'll soon find out. Right. Just want to get to uh, RK5 today. We'll pick up that while we're here, and then after that, uh, next episode, we'll, uh, we'll take him down a few times. Uh, oh, we'll pick him up. Why not? Right. Let's see if we can get a super duper easy guardian kill here. 
And this time the board is behind me. You've been Tacitar. One more word to me. Tacitar. Oi! Sod. Oh. I'll be seeing you soon. Boom. Boom. Oh, sod off, woman. Once your shield's gone, you're pretty weak though, aren't you? Ah, not that weak. Um, more guardians. Let's see what EXE brings us now. Ah! Funzerker. It's doing absolutely nothing. Oh, we'll get it on this guardian, actually. This is going to absolutely eat the living hell out of my ammo. Quick, get up. Wow, this thing really isn't very good. Oh, thank God for that Nova Blast. I say, this uh, really isn't good for getting yourself back up on. Right. Top up on ammo, last little section. And then we'll be good to end the episode, I think. Let's get a couple of grenades out, sod it, why not? Get that eternal down, stop him from ascending. I'm gonna corrode myself here. Right, there should be more eternals in the next section. And uh, then we are through to, uh, I can't remember what it's called. Is it actually called the dig site? I think he might be though, but let's slam this guy. And uh, we'll slam this guy. Knock him off uh, from ascending. Right, plenty of ammo needed now. And it gives me none. Cheers. Is that it? Only two guys? I thought more than that appeared. Obviously not. Well, there we go. So, let's take a last look at Virago Solitude before we go to the dig site. Pumping station, that's it. And uh, <coughs> hey, sod it! Should we have a quick go at? Should we have a quick go at RK5? Hey! Oh! Uh, you shall never surrender. Right now, I'm going to leave the RK5 kill to the next. Get some uh, ammo on the go. Right, we just need corrosive. Pure ass corrosive. Let's mass sell everything we don't want. Right, what have we got? I don't think we've got third level 13 blowfly. Wow. Um, no, <laughs> we haven't got anything corrosive. Decent, apart from the blowfly. I reckon the blowfly will do it though. Well, there you go anyway, guys. We are uh, ready for the RK5 fight. Um, he's actually really, quite really good for XP as well, so uh, we'll definitely, definitely, le well, definitely level to 29 on uh, the first run. But uh, I might see how good the XP is. If I can uh, take him down three or four times and uh, nearly climb to level 30, that'll be really handy for the uh, Sentinel battle. But, uh, yeah, that's it anyway, guys. Hope you've enjoyed another Legendary run. Like I said, um, just, I don't think there's any more bosses now that drop Legendaries. Um till the sentinel which sentinel should be too long actually so uh yeah two or three more episodes but for them two or three episodes i think we're just going to try and prepare for the sentinel fight do some major uh, vendor farming and uh, maybe a little bit of uh, other source farming like uh i don't know uh benjamin blue like he's a good one uh, he drops legendaries not that often but um i can get a legendary off him so i might um like that uh, but after that, yeah, Sentinel time. So uh, and then we we'll think we've just got Iwajira and uh, Nell to farm. And uh, that will be pretty much it for the vanilla game till uh, DLC. And then we'll go through the DLC and get all them legendaries as well. So, uh, yeah, still plenty to look forward to anyway. Thanks for watching, everyone. I'll see you guys in the next episode.